At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson, and we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It is Manchester City taking on Liverpool. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. And so the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson stands between the posts. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And this is how Liverpool start the game. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Joel Matty plays alongside Virgil van Dijk in central defence. Thiago starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Possession and patience, the watchwords. And using his body to good effect. Well, you can't watch Kevin De Bruyne and not be impressed, I think it's fair to say, Stuart. What in particular do you expect to see from him in this game? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. Oh, he's lost possession. Rodri just straying offside <laughs> Luis Diaz Thiago still level here but the pressure escalating. And offside, unfortunately. <laughs> Ruben Diaz. Extremely sloppy in possession. Henderson. Here's Fabinho. And a goal! Liverpool strike first in the final. And just listen to the fans. Well, as you can see, he makes it look easy in the end, but I think that's a good finish. He'll be pleased with that. So the action continues, and City looking to offer a swift response to that setback. Joao Cancelo. Rodri. Well, can they open up the defence here? A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. Well, the referee saw it as a bookable offence. And I think he's got it absolutely right. That was a poor challenge, you have to say.
had it on target, but it was never going to trouble the keeper. Rodri. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. Well, those stats don't lie. Liverpool haven't controlled the ball, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. Andrew Robertson. And the penalty has been given here. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty, yes. Yellow card, no. Can they extend their lead? And the keeper denies them from the spot. And a short corner here. And it's Salah with the cross. And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Good pressure to regain possession. Not a good pass. Gabriel Jesus. Holland. Walker now. De Bruyne. Walker. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. A bit of running room now on the wing. Options in the middle. Andrew Robertson. And keeping it out. And so it is, the first half story has been written. And the referee gets the second half going. Liverpool with the lead. Will they be able to hold on to it? Fabinho. Well, it's one pass after another. Andrew Robertson. Fabinho now. Nunez. And Thiago. No luck in terms of finding the target. the kind of shielding play you expect from him De Bruyne Holland Rodri well he read that brilliantly at the back Thiago oh, a lovely incisive pass Henderson and diving to thwart him.
Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Possession lost, intercepted. Roberto Firmino. A danger here as he runs at them. High quality defending. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. All hands on deck. Well, that's one for them to pursue. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. Twenty minutes to go. Thiago. Beautifully weighted ball. Robertson. And played towards the near post. Not a touch off the defender last of all, so a corner. Trying to deliver it accurately. Found wanting a bit with that delivery. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. Holland. And a body in the way. Was spot on with that challenge. Alexander Arnold. Well, it's a great advantage to any side when you're as comfortable on the ball as they are. Luis Diaz. Moving the ball effectively. Fabinho. And Mohamed Salah now. Here's Firmino. Well, what a good start to keep them in this. Well, that would have been game over. Not long left now, though. And time for the change now. Number four, Virgil van Dijk. To be replaced by... Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Got to it easily, the keeper. There's still time for them to level it. But they took care of the situation defensively. Well, three minutes of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. It is to be a throw-in. continues his run Rodri and does well to keep it in play Jack Grealish and there goes the final whistle the cup issue is settled a story of one side celebrating and the other distraught memories are being made well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity.
Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Full marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time.